today I would like to show you spatial temporal phenological matrix measuring of intercropping based on FPAR at regional scale using Google Engine. FPAR is defined as the fraction of incident fit photosynthetically active radiation. The spectral resolution is around 400 to 700 nanometers absorbed by um, the green elements of uh, vegetation canopy. Can 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 so as we you know, the um, spectral resolution is around 400 to 700 is very sensitive to the um, green area, for example, forest, um, um, crop, or any um, agricultural crop. So why this uh, tutorial is very important. So if we would like to know that area when they start off season, okay, when they plant it, so we can use the um, remote sensing or um, um, satellite images to extract that um, digital number value of that pixel. And then we can use that one to calculate the start of season. So in the slide I show you, uh, this one is have uh, six regions. The first one uh, in the north. Second R stand for region. R one is uh, regional one, R two regional two until R six regional six. So in each area, they plant different crop type. For example, R1 they plant um, two crop types. The major crop, um, the first one is rice, second one is um, cassava. For example, another one is the um, R6. Most of that area, they um, plant most uh, by sugar cane. So, this uh, this uh, figure I show you what it is in the the, the tutorial we will cal calculate. The next one, uh, we can use Google Engine to extract digital number by um, spatial temporal, and then we can plot by using Excel file to see the the um, the beha behavior on a surface by using uh, FPAR. So the the green bar here is it is the average of rain season, uh, rainfall season. Um, start from the first until the end of this uh, that year. So you can see that the start of season is around day of year is around two hundred. So this means that the uh, this the farmer can plant the uh, plant the crop in the rainy season if, it's, if you see the graph the next one is I separate the um, FPR value so to extract the when uh, which region start of this one. so we have the uh, equation here the absolute FPAR mean mean is mean the minimum number here and minus FPAR max max is, is mean right hand side here for example this one and then um, multiply 0 0.1 is mean threshold normally we, we can set threshold 0 0.1 0 0.2 or 0 0.3 it depends on educational purpose after that we can uh, plus um, FPR min here because we would like to see uh, I should point out here the FPR, uh, FPR min minus FPR max in absolute is mean the amplitude so I I um, mentioned this one in the 
in my channel you can go to and, and observe it what it is so in the first region the start of this around day of year 213 the second one is 210 209 until 211 so uh, this one uh, the start of season but if you would like to calculate peak of season or ending of season you can um, use another equation but it is not difficult so shall we move to the the GE code here okay the first one I have the secret uh, region now we can click one first okay one so in this um, GE code is we use I use the smoothing and um, original value so the, the smooth curve I use um, whisker function okay I would not say uh, in detail in this um, code but I if, if you would like to have it you can email me so I will give you uh, all, the, all the code here so 